There's a friend in Fimble Valley that we're on our way to see. To hear him tell his stories, maybe stay for tea. He's a mole who's living underground, and his name is Roly Mo. Roly, 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 Roly Mo. He's the rolliest mole you'll ever know, and his name is Roly Mo. Hello to you. How do you do? <laughs> I'm having such a special day. My best friend had her birthday at school today, and now I'm here for tea with Uncle Rolly. Shall we go and find him? Ready? Then off we go! Hello there. And how are you today? I'm just writing in my diary. Hello, Uncle Rolly. Oh, hello there, little Bo. I was just telling our friends that I'm writing about something special in my diary. Oh. What are you writing about, Uncle Rolly? Well, have a look through my rolly scope. Oh. Come and see. Oh, your fluffy puffs. The flowers have come out. They look beautiful. Is that what you were writing about in your di... di... My diary? Yes, that's right. I want to remember when my fluffy puffs came out, so I'm writing it down in my diary. Oh, I'm very good at remembering things. Busy book, busy book, let's take a look. Someone is hiding. Who can it be? Is it a thimble? Who can you see? It's Baby Pom. What are we going to do today, Baby Pom? Oh, look. There's a teddy bear. And a car. And that's a carrot. And there's a book. There are four things. One, two, three, four. Look at them very carefully. How many things are left now? There are one, two, three things left. Something is missing. What can it be? Can you remember? Oh, is it the teddy bear? Yes, it's the teddy bear. The teddy bear was missing. Now we've got four things again. The teddy bear, a carrot, a car and a book. Oh, something's gone again. What's missing this time? Can you remember what's missing this time? Here's a clue. It's something orange. It's the carrot. The carrot was missing. Thank you, Pom. See you again soon. I'd like to have a diary too, Uncle Rolly. Well, now, let me see. Hmm. <laughs> ah, what have I got here? Oh, thank you, Uncle Rolly. Oh, but there's nothing in it. Well, that's because you need to put your own rememberings in it. But I'm still learning to do my letters. Well, if you can't write the words, then you can always draw a picture. Oh, look, Uncle Rolly. I'm putting something in my diary. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That means I'm having a special day today. You go! Me go! We, we go! go. Amigo! Let's a go go! What are you doing, little Bo? I'm putting something in my diary. Your diary? My diary. Why are you putting something in your diary? I'm putting down that you're here, so that I can remember it later. 
But of course we're here. I bet you can't remember, member, what we had for tea last Tuesday. Of course I can't. Well, I can! <laughs> That's what we had last Tuesday. Uh, is that sprout and carrot stew? It is. It was yummy tea! I don't need anything to help me remember. I'm good at remembering. I know. Let's play a remembering game. Do you know one, Uncle Roly? Well, yes. As a matter of fact, I do. And to play the game, you each need to go and find a thing for me. Oh. oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> one pencil. Uh, one hat. One cushion. Well done. Now, put them on the sofa, please. One pencil. One hat. One cushion. Hmm. Now, take a good look at them so you can remember what's there. <clears throat> cushion. Hat. Pencil. Ready? Ready. Ready? Ready. Ready. And now you all have to turn around, please, and I'm going to take one of these things away. <gasps> you can turn around now. Now, can you tell me what I've taken away? <gasps> You've taken something away! That's the game, Miko. We have to remember what's been taken away. Oh. Mm. Well... It's not the hat. And it's not the pencil. It's the cushion. Yes, it is. Yes, it's the cushion. Ooh, well done, Hugo. Let's play again. All right, then. You take the pencil and the hat away, and I'll see what else I've got. <laughs> hmm. Ah, yes. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Now, look carefully. One slipper. One moo. One book. And turn around. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now you can look. Now, what have I taken away? Um, hmm. I know. It's the book. Oh, oh, well done. You're all very good at remembering. And can you remember what's in the book? Stories! Let's see if you can all remember the book song, then. When you take a look inside a book Who knows what you will see? When you take a look inside a book It's fun as fun can be With cats and dogs and birds and frogs. A monkey who says boo, boo! Wonderful things, giants and kings. And maybe a thimble or two. Now what have we here? Uh, when you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Hmm. Books over here, books over there. Find me a book with a story to share. A story to remember, if you please. Ah, thank you. Now then, are you all sitting comfortably? Yes. Good. Then I'll begin. Hmm. Grandad had been staying with Ben and Charlie, but now he had to go home. He lived far away on the other side of the world, so the twins didn't see him very often. They liked having Grandad at their house. They liked his untidy eyebrows and yeah. his deep, growly voice. Uh, yeah. And the way he tickled them when they weren't looking. <laughs> Come and live with us forever, Grandad, said Ben. I'll let you have my football, said Charlie. But Grandad had to go home to look after his dog, Sheba. Ben and Charlie wanted to know about Sheba. Here's a photo, said Grandad. It helps me remember what she looks like. 
Sheba was a spily black dog. The boys thought that Sheba was the sort of dog they liked. When you go back home, how will you remember us? asked Charlie. Hmm, said Grandad. You could take a photo, said Ben. So they all went outside so that Mum could take a photograph for Grandad. Grandad smiled and said, Cauliflower cheese, which made them all laugh. Snap! That afternoon, Grandad went home. But a few weeks later, a parcel arrived for Ben and Charlie. And in it were two T-shirts with kangaroos on them and a photo. There were Ben and Charlie and Grandad in the garden, all smiling. I liked that day when Grandad said, Cauliflower cheese, said Ben. Look, you can see Grandad's funny eyebrows, said Charlie. And Mum put the photo in a special frame so they could look at it and remember Grandad. Ah, lovely. What you putting in your jar o now, little Bo? I'm putting down all the things we've done today. First you came along, and then we played a game, and Uncle Roly told us a story. What a special day we've had. My very special day goes like this. My very special day starts with a kiss. My very special day is being with you. My very special day is playing with you too. My very special day is always the same. My very special day is snootling in the rain. My very special day, splish, splash, splosh. My very special day is not having to wash. My very special day, something good to eat. <laughs> My very special day, a special tea time treat. My very special day, yummity, yummity, yum. I really love to strum My very special day Taking a look My very special day Inside a good book My very special day A story to share It's such a special day Well, there's just one thing left to make it an extra special day. What's that, Uncle Roly? Guacamole for tea. Yippity dippity! And I've got a space for it right here on my bibby. <laughs> so I'll always remember, remember it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've had a remembering day today, haven't we? Yes, yes it's, it's been, been a roly moly day. day. You will remember to come and join us next time in Fimble Valley, won't you? Now it's time for us all to go. Cheerio! Cheerio! We go. Yes, little bow. How many moly munches have you eaten? Oh, um, I can't remember. <laughs>